Guys, welcome back to Let's Play Legend of Mana. It's almost time to go see the wonderful, wonderful city of Oz. Um, I figure I should just like stop pulling so many artifacts. So it's about time I go and place the Tome of Magic. Um, I just gotta look over my notes here where I want it. I want it in this hole. Uh, Tome of Magic, not the Pirate Hook, not the Green King, the Tome of Magic. Boom. But, there's something we want to do first, so we're not going to go to Geo. I'm just going to, like, be a huge tease and put it down. For the sake of actually having it down. And then I think I want to go... No, I want to be on this side, I think. Yeah, because I need to be able to have the corner there for the pirate hook. So I'm going to put the green cane down here. Bring White Forest. Holy shit, hold on. I gotta go to the underworld first. God damn it. Is he gonna turn left? Okay, good. I fixed it. We are going to try and finish up the dragon. Quest line. If not this episode, then the next one, because I think there's two quests left to it. And to do that, we need to pick up Lark. Come on, buddy, let's go. No, like, let's go. Let's go. There we go. Into the forest. Alright. Oh, come on. My mouse fell off of it. No, go to the white forest. Go into the white forest. And we will start the next part, which I think is like... Let's say the white dragon. Is it the white dragon? No. What's this quest called? Territory of Vadis, the white dragon. No, maybe the quest is called the white dragon. Something in this forest that throws off my senses. What do you mean? The one who wants to keep me away. You'll see. Is it your sister? Yeah, concentrate on picking up her scent. You should leave me. Do not worry about the details. It will be alright. It's like putting his hands up like some kind of weird sign. Let's go. Okay. I forget if I, uh, if that came up in the... You're right, I sense her I mean, there's only one fucking exit, buddy. God damn it. Um, although it is nice that he actually like will confirm the direction he's supposed to be going. I'm not used to seeing these like relatively basic but I mean, okay, these things are like tearing them apart face. I'm not used to seeing these like relatively low level enemies with like two bars of HP. It's a little weird. Now Lark is leaving all my HP. Where's my golem? Oh he's in the trees, I see. Alright, let's go. Just only one exit. Right, this is okay. So he's gonna confirm every single screen. Way to go! All right, that's correct again. Oh shit, that's right. I wanted to trade the golem away for like the succubus or something. Maybe I'll do that between these episodes. And I have to stop and like drop off at home and talk to the cactus anyway. Mushroom and the, oh, delicious experience that nobody but me really needs. Um, yep, that's the only exit. Okay, I don't need you to confirm when it's the only exit lock. Uh, what was I gonna say earlier? I don't remember. Ooh, chest. I don't remember if uh, it came up in Bone Fortress or not, or if it was just too subtle, and I, whether or not I talked about it at all. But Lark and Sierra are brother and sister. Oh man, another wooding. I don't like use. I mean, I'm not. Maybe he's gonna cut me off there. Not going to do much at all. No, not really. He's going to him. Kill the rabbit with all the magic. I got rid of it. Ah, oh, it's just candy. Alright. 
Sweet. Do, um, I think... I think there's an enemy. Oh man, a new enemy! The Silk Spitter. I don't... I don't even remember ever seeing that. This might be the only place you fight that. Like this one screen right here or something? Because I don't ever remember seeing that enemy before. I don't remember what it does. It drops. What enemy type it is and where the egg would be. I don't remember anything about the damn thing. No, nope, animal meat. Oh, uh, this way? Okay, good. I know where I'm going. Now we want to turn because there's a chest down there. We're closing in. See, is this the right way here? Ah, alright, we're good. Just to show me the one more, I think. Just a straight. Oh no, we have to kill the monster. Uh, let's use Painter Black, because I think that should hit both of them. I think Painter Black does like the most damage. It also is the coolest spell I have. I mean, I throw my staff in second and use a black hole. It doesn't get a whole lot cooler than that. Nice, cool. Alright, 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 alright. Cool. There we go. This should be. Yep, now the music is changing. The ancient tree. There's Sierra. Lark. So you will finally come this far. Where is Vadis? Can you not see what Jacronis is trying to do? You did not already slay dragons for the sake of revenge. She's trying to snatch man energy. Yeah. Do you not know what happened? Whatever. I like Lark's attitude here. Yeah, I know I'm doing everything to destroy everything. I don't give a shit. I want to come back to life. Don't fuck with me. Can't let anyone disrupt the world, even if it's my own brother. Okay, so at the very least, there. Yeah, that's it. And then the white dragon shows up and says, Stop. Which the white dragon kind of looks like a giant cat. With horns. It did, it, it's not something I would have pegged as a dragon. It looks like. It looks like that thing from the never ending story. The giant white thing that they wrote on. I don't remember its name. It kind of looks like that. And it's going straight down my path. Good dragon. Go lark and see the air of your wings. But I have a plan, don't worry. Yeah, I don't know, if your plan is anything like your current plan, it's probably not going to go too well. Oh, cool, I'm done. Lorimar Iron. That seems really pathetic. Like, where's my E-shaped Platinum? I've been dragged in, but there's no going back now. If Chikos does not stop, the entire world will suffer. It doesn't turn your back. Yeah, okay. Show me your powers. Now I have to beat the dragon anyway. Actually, I might not have to beat the dragon. I might just have to beat Sierra. Oh, yeah, the robot spits candy. That's where it's coming from. Alright. Well, let's paint it black. Ah, good girl. Or her. I. I seem to remember you this fight being interesting because you, you fight two bosses at once for one. Which only happens like twice ever really. I mean there's the two things like you just fought. Sweet laser beam, good job. Oh shit. Get out of that, get out of that. I don't care what it does, I don't even need it. Oh man, I'm getting torn the fuck up. this. Um, this is not going so well. I feel like you only have to actually kill one of them. Ah, shit. Hmm. This might prove to be a bit of a problem. I certainly do not think we're going. It's going to be good enough here. Come on, come on, come on. Don't 
Got him, he got him. I might get the gold mess without candy, the better I think. Golem is basically trashed here. Uh, he's only been able to actually be good because I have the okay. because I have the benefit of um, being good and having a good partner with me. And when half my benefits go away, all of a sudden I'm in a bad spot. I think I got. I don't like how she can get out of my, like, staff stone wall. But she's almost dead. And can I kill her? No. So I'm gonna come back there. I thought maybe you only have to kill her it was, like, the sweet gimmick of the fight, but I guess I was wrong. I mean, the white dragon's not that hard now. Can't really hit me. Or maybe you can. I don't know if shit. Maybe you can just poke me next time. Oh, there we are. Got the skill up just before it did this one. So, slip in the black hole. I'll heal a little bit. Oh, it makes my magic get worse when this black hole. That's not good. Let's tag your body fleet here. Uh, there's like nothing and my magic's been like absolutely pulled down. Shit. Oh no, here. There we Super scummy, but I'm gonna do it. Oh, oh yeah, I dodged it. Kill him. Sweet. Could have sworn you only need to fight Sierra, but maybe you need to fight them both. I mean, apparently you absolutely need to fight them both. Ah, my powers are excellent. I want that framed and printed and hung on my wall. My powers are excellent. I think does he send her with us? Maybe not. Nope, doesn't look like it. The Dragon Princess, it was called, not the White Dragon. God damn it. Making a fool of myself. Alright. First things first. We go home and talk to the cactus. Then, we drop off the golem. We pick up the succubus. And start using that instead. I think I should also mark off on my like list here that we are on to the last bit of the dragon quest. I'm pretty sure it's the last quest, but for now, I don't want to miss talking about cactus. I swear to god, if I get to the end of this LP and I missed one quest for the little cactus, I'll probably just move on with my life, but it'll it'll upset me a lot for a little bit. Had to be dog. I, I think they're wolves, not dogs, but whatever floats your boat, cactus. Alright, before I forget, I'm dumping this awful golem. I've basically screwed the entire golem thing up, so we're just going to drop him. Let's pick him up, drop him on the goddamn floor. Do 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 goes all this way, I think. Nope, that's instruments. God damn it. Screen off. Do 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 Leave Golem. Vroom. Okay. And we'll make a quick stop where we pick up the succubus. And we'll run on over and finish up this quest line. 
I'm trying to remember where the other demi-humans are. Goblins and Lumina, the Chobin Hood. Where is the Chobin Hood? I know the Chobin Hood is somewhere. That's another one you can get. It's not Luan Highway. I know that. We'll pop in the snowfields and we'll pick up a succubus. I, I'm trying to remember if after you pick up the demi-humans, you can put them in your barn or if they just go back to where you found them and I can't remember whether or not they'll actually go to your barn afterwards but oh, right, I have to actually kill things on the way in there oh come on I'm also going to have to kill them on the way out I guess I'm all screwed up now. I can't even kill things officially. Alright, moving on. Let's just try to paint this black. Because it should kill all of them. Black hole. Boom, all dead. Perfect. Ah, uh, that's alive. That's understandable. Zombies aren't. Zombies are like resistant to black holes. You know. They, uh, come on, I'm done. They come in, black hole hits them, they don't really care. It's just, that's nature's way of saying you're zombies. When you fall into a black hole and you come out the other side, okay. I think that was the whole point of Interstellar. Come on, hit the damn dinosaur. That's not a dinosaur. It's some kind of like, oddity. I saved that right at the end, I think. Um, is she here? I thought she was right here. Maybe she's down here. Maybe I don't know where I'm going at all, and I'm gonna just look at a giant idiot wasting time getting the same place. Depending on how much time I waste, I can move the dragon into the finale of the dragon. So I think that quest is actually a little long. Or at least it's one of those things where it's gonna have like a bunch of dialogue. Where things are getting kind of dramatic because oh my sister is my sworn enemy. Oh, delicious money that I'll never be able to actually spend wisely. Let's finish this off with a black hole. <laughs> And as we talked about earlier, zombies are resistant to black holes. Rotten. Zombies are rotten. Did you know that? Doo -doo -doo. Is she here? I thought she was here. Ah, there she is. Alicia. So, what did she say? Cookie and Uzi. Uh, she's at level 1. Absorb the enemy's damage points. Huh. Alright, we need to like level her up a ton. Which should happen on the way out, hopefully. But we'll go back, we'll read Little Cactus's little message, and then I think... Oh gee, she's like super fragile. And we will do the End of Dragons on the next quest, or on the next video. with these zombies. Level them up once. Luckily I have that uh, sweet ring that lets me send experience her way. And paint it black just like Insta gives things that aren't zombies, because things that aren't zombies don't resist black holes. Oh shit. Scratch the holes on these race black holes. Maybe I'm just garbage. And a spear. Pretty sure it was just going to the right to get out. For some reason, I'm like super against doing fights on the way in. Because 
It serves like no purpose, except to level me up. And on the way out, I'm all about doing the fights to get her some experience. And then... I don't know. It's weird, because it's like... It's not enough that it's going to give her enough levels to matter. She's still going to get, like, instantly offed by everybody. And her AI is also still garbage, so... Alright, there should be enough to paint black to finish these guys. Move along. Oh, perfect. That feels really good. Just watch them instantly drop. Uh, I should probably take off the dice ring that's giving me more loot, because it's the opposite of what we want right now. We want more experience, but at the same time, I do want more loot, so. There we go. She took one, that's fine. She's the one standing there. Anyway. I think this next one should lead to the world map. Yep, yeah, there we go. So head back, we'll read our Cactus Diary, and then we will... call it there for now, and finish Dragons next time. And I think I should probably place that pirate hook at some point here. Um, I thought about going and checking and seeing if I could drop her off in the stable, but whatever, I'll just bring her with me. I should put something in her feed box before I, like, go, though. I'll probably do that off-screen. Uh, I already talked to you, right? What was that quest called? It was not the White Dragon, it was Dragon Princess, I think? Mm, there it is, Dragon Princess. Lark is working for his boss because he wants to get out of there, but I think he's enjoying it. I've got to see him to learn the truth. You do kind of got to see him to learn the truth, yeah. Alright, I'm just going to go quickly. I'll just do it on camera, because less work for me. But run over here and we will toss some food that I have no idea how it affects her AI into her feed box just so I am doing something to her stats. Uh, move pet feed. Oh, uh, yes. Feed box empty. Of course it is. Um, should probably give her, like, meat. Dragon steak seems like it can only be good, right? Um, magical meat, maybe? Maybe we'll give her, like, demon meat. Those all sound like things she would enjoy. I'm not gonna worry about the chocolate. Not that I care. Anyway, thanks for watching, guys, and I'll see you next time. Bye for now.